Uh, my name's Chris Weil and uh, I've been singing Johnny Mitchell songs for as long as I can remember. Um, after establishing my own career and writing my own songs for a number of years, um, I decided with some friends to put a band together called Blue Tapestry to celebrate the music of Johnny Mitchell and Carol King. Um, it was fantastic, we had a great time, did three tours and made an album. Um, <clears throat> But one of the biggest uh, challenges for me was to learn to play all the different tunings uh, properly, as did Joni. Um, amazing creations that she, that she brought into the world. Uh, 57 different tunings over guitar and dulcimer. So um, I've been asked to perhaps do, you know, show people how to use these tunings. So this is the first in a series of masterclasses. I'm going to start quite simple. Uh, with a case of you, um, all the chords are the same, all the tune, all the strings are tuned to the same note. Um, very, very simple to learn. Um, it's all about the feel and the rhythm uh, of the song. When you're using a dulcimer to um, accompany a song rather than to play tunes on it, it really is about feel and rhythm. So um, I'll show you the chords first, and then. I'll demonstrate how to play the song. This is a standard dulcimer, Appalachian dulcimer, um, which I bought in Appalachia actually uh, a couple of years ago. Uh, but it's got one more fret than what I'm than what I'm used to. This one here. Um, and although I'm getting used to it, it's a beautiful thing. Uh, a McSpadden from Arkansas. It's a lovely thing. But I'm going to play my other one to demonstrate case of you because I'm. I'm used to it. I will get used to this one. <clears throat> so you can see uh, <laughs> this one hasn't got this fret here, right? So it's got 17 frets. Um, it should have six strings too, but I, I only use four. A double here, single, single. As you can hear, they're all tuned to the same. I have them tuned uh, all to G. In case of you, you can change the key to suit the pitch of your voice, but as long as all the strings are the same. Um, and there's just one shape to use in the whole of uh, the whole song. And it's um, it's the top string and the double, the bass string and the double, and they're and they're a fret apart. So up and down. It's really, really easy. Um, so um, I'll show you the intro uh, just to demonstrate uh, how, how easy it is. And also, this is a really good tip. See, this non-stick stuff, you know, that you non-slip material. I put it on the bottom because dulcimers have a habit of falling off your knee. <laughs> okay, so this is the intro. lovely so lovely I love that intro a nice floppy plectrum really helps um, and a, a real towards you and out you kind of hit it Just before our love got lost, you said I'm as constant as the northern star in Constantly in the darkness, where's that eye? If you want me, I'll be in the bar
stretched on her toys. Ooh, you're a bubbler like holy wine. It tastes so bitter and so sweet. Oh, I to drink a case of you, darling. And I would still be on my feet. I would still be on my box of things and I'm frightened by the devil but I'm drawn to those ones that ain't afraid I remember that time you told me you said love is touching souls and surely you touch mine cause part of you goes out of me can always do this the ending as well which is um okay i uh, hope you can go and get your dulcimer out of its dusty box now and uh practice one of the most beautiful songs in the world um, case of you. Easy, really easy start I think. Um, I'll be coming back in a month or so, uh, maybe before, uh, to tackle California. Uh, so thanks for coming and watching, hope you enjoyed it and uh, good luck. <laughs>